Hi, I'm Debbie and welcome to my channel Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for March 18th and 19th, Monday and Tuesday for my Cancers. Hello my Cancers, how are you all? Okay, um, I'm feeling good for you. I'm feeling, okay, but let's do my stuff first. Uh, I'm using short and short readings. I just use my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused with Reiki energy. And this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. But I'm feeling good energy for you. Right off the bat, I can tell you that Monday and Tuesday, it's kind of this energy that, yeah, I'm not saying that, okay, that, that the, the, the day is going to go without problems, but it's like this energy, like you're, you're really feeling now that you can handle what life throws at you, okay? There's a lot of things that go on. You know, part is just life itself, and part of it is all the energies of the people around us and energies that people, even people far, and I don't know where I'm going with this, but people far away put out into this world. It's like, it's like everything is merging together. It's time, space, continuum type of thing for you. Um, I really feel that this, is, that you though, are, your confidence has grown so much and I, I'm, I'm happy for that. I'm happy for that. So now, on the 20th, there is a lot of stuff going on, a lot of energy. Everybody, it's not just on the 20th, that has been leading up and people have been feeling it. Um, you know, we have that Libra moon, full moon, super moon, third super moon in a row. And then this Libra moon, Libra energy, I'm not saying Libra people, but Libra energy love balance. They love to have um, justice served. Or, I mean, Libra energy loves justice to be served. So this this is going to be a time that if you are if you are in some sort of a court case or whatever, justice will be served. You know, coming into this now. The interesting thing now this is the super moon, so very strong. But next month is also a Libra moon. It will not be a super moon, but it's like Libra wants. It's this. It's like the the divine energies are out there to say we need to reset. We need to realign. We need to get things back into a better place. Okay. So yes. Yeah, so just just know that that justice is going to be served. Okay. I I do have an article about that moon um, on my Facebook that I really liked. So I would suggest going there. Um, also, we, you know, Aries is the new astrological, started the new astrological year. There's just so much newness here. So let's see what the cards are saying for my cancers. Okay, let's see. The first one is reversed. So this is a very powerful message for you. It's the 10 of Earth. Earth is our Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. It's what we can feel. It's our money situation. It's our home. And this is saying a very happy family life, financial security, finding magic in the little things of life. Now, I will tell you that it seems that all of my readings have not just been for this Monday, Tuesday. It's kind of like it's setting you up for the next, for this, this moon and this astrological year. So I am feeling like things are coming together for the thing that you hold dear to you. And for more, most cancers, it's that they, you know, not to say that people don't irritate you inside the family, but family and home is something that you hold very dear, okay? So let's see, the next one is reversed, and this one is the Ace of Fire. Fire is our Aries energy, which we're going into, Leo and our Sagittarius, and this is an exciting new opportunity, career advancement, changing your life now. This goes along with what we've been talking about, so it's like, it's like, you know, I've, and again, I'm really feeling that this has been, these readings have been more of a longer term reading. It's like the divine is coming down and saying, hey, cancers, things that you thought. No, things are changing. You know, we've seen your struggles. We've seen how much you fought. We've got your back. And it's not only that we have your back, it's we're going to carry you through this time also because Libra energy wants balance and it wants justice, okay? So, does it mean that you just sit back and don't do anything? Oh, no, 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 not at all. And that's the thing, is that people will come to me and ask me about stuff, and I can tell them, if you, know, if you do this, this is going to work out like this. And some people are like, okay, and they do that. And they come back and say, yes. 
And other people are like, well, no, I didn't do this. And some people I tell them, you're not going to do this, though. And they go, yeah, you're right. But now I know what happens if I did do that. So it's like, okay. But I feel for you, Cancer, that it's like, I feel like you're being, you know, you know that song, you know, the, what is it, the wind beneath my wings? It's like, this is your wind beneath your wings moment. And it's not just going to be a two-day moment. It's like, this is carrying you through, okay? So, and I, and you, you definitely need this, my Cancers. Okay. I also feel like the people that have been working really long hours, that that's going to change too. Now that could you not be when that happens. People are like, "Oh, good," and it's like, "Well, maybe you're gonna lose your job." But I, but if you, if that is because of a job loss per se, I think you'll get extra extra money because of that. I don't know why, but I also think that you'll find another way to make money because, again, the wind is on is you know the wind is beneath your wings. But I feel like there's that there's a lot of cancers that have been very very overworked. And I mean, an overworked, you know, like I signed up for 40 and why am I doing 80 type of overwork and still getting paid for 40. Okay. So I almost feel like there's, and again, this is weird. I'm just, but I have to say it when it comes, I feel like there might be a lawsuit for people that were, that were doing that working 80 for 40 and that you'll get compensated, not quite now, but down the road, you'll get compensated for the time that was stolen from you. Don't know why that's coming, but that's what I'm feeling. And if you aren't in that situation, then take that because I feel that there's going to be compensation. Compensation is coming to you. Okay, let's see what this last card is. Again, this one is reversed too. And when it's reversed, I know we took a peek of it. When it's reversed, it means it's a stronger message to you. So this one, five of water, water is your energy. Okay, also it is Pisces and Scorpio energy. Things not turning out the way you'd hoped, not seeing the positives in a situation, crying over spilled milk. Again, that goes back to the example that I just said. You're doing 80 and you're getting paid for 40, you know, so, and, you know, and maybe you might lose your job, but you say, but then you go, but I, you know, but you're going to regain your health. You know, I mean, it's like, it's like you've got an idea of what you want, but... <laughs> <laughs> but the divine guardian angels, spirit guides, higher power is saying, yeah, that's what you want, but, you know, but sweetie, <laughs> male or female, you need to go this way. If you really need to go, okay, let's go this way. You need to go this way, okay? You really need to do it our way instead of your way. And again, it's, again, it's that wings, that wind beneath your wings and while you want to, you know, here it is, you're the, here, we'll go this way. Here, you're the bird, and the wind is pushing you this way, and or you want to go this way, but the wind then pushes you to go that other way. And it's the other way that actually brings you that happiness that you're looking for, or that you've been, you've been seeking, you've been questing, you've been just needing, okay? So I'm really excited that this is... You know, as you go into this new year, this new astrological year, it really seems that things are finally coming for you, coming together for you, my Cancers. I like it. I like it a lot. So, my Cancers, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.